My name is uh, Robert Bryant and I am a gastroenterologist at the Queen Elizabeth Hospital and Basil Hetzel Institute. So inflammatory bowel diseases, it's a term encompassing ulcerative colitis and Crohn's disease. Rates of inflammatory bowel disease are rising worldwide and Australia has some of the highest rates in the world. It seems that these rising rates of IBD are closely correlated with changes in the gut microbiota which are associated with modern lifestyle. So our plan is to undertake microbial manipulation using faecal microbiota transplantation and dietary strategies so as to improve uh, the composition and diversity of the gut microbes and thereby treat disease. Fecal microbiota transplantation or FMT involves transplanting these good organisms into the gut um, of someone with an illness, inflammatory bowel disease. And the aim is to, um, for those organisms to then engraft and take hold in the gut and then proliferate to create a stable and healthy ecosystem. Part of our research involves defined dietary strategies. These are specific diets with recipe plans and they're created by academic dietitians. And that is like the fertilizer for the FMT. So we have the right nutrients um, to be able to allow those organisms to, to be happy and healthy within the gut. So the dietary strategies that we adopt are whole food diets. So we don't believe in just nutraceuticals, adding something in. We take the entire diet into account and really the dietary strategies that we're proposing, they have specific aims, but they're also healthy whole food diets. In terms of results thus far, we've conducted a seminal randomised control trial of FMT in ulcerative colitis, which did show remission induction, healing of inflammation in a good proportion of patients and at least as much as modern therapy. We've conducted a pilot dietary intervention, which showed um, success in terms of healing inflammation. And currently we have underway a randomised control trial testing this dietary strategy in patients with ulcerative colitis. By improving care and efficacy of therapy for patients with inflammatory bowel disease. Over time, we hope to look towards cure. I think um, cure of inflammatory bowel disease would be um, using a combination of therapies, but I certainly think microbial manipulation is part of that future therapeutic paradigm.